giving all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shai by Hashem, Akakwadash, the born of the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone, and the sincere shalom to the Akin that's out there pushing the sincerity and the truth and the sound doctrine. This is going to be a real quick video on this. Um, this is a video that brother uh, GMS Amawan Abad 144 put up. And the Jake that was that that was doing a video, uh, not uh, the the one that he put up, the the one that was doing a video was showing these images of, of us looking like this and flames and all this other stuff. And it, it, he was the, 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 it was it was spiritual because you know hey it, it's it's good you know and it, it's great that Jake is waking up man you know and that's what they're afraid of and that's what pretty much what the, what the Jake was uh, saying. And then after after the clip played, that's when the brother, you know, was was going in on this. When the older brother was going in on this, you know, uh, topic, right? So as you see here, his his title name is a spiritual trend is is established because like I said, everybody's starting to realize that. Oh yeah, now that now that we're, you know, waking up to the fact that we've been lied to, and still are being lied to. Now, now, all of a sudden, it's a big issue. They want to flag our videos and stuff like that. So I think my, I think the title of this video is going to be and another thing, because I'm kind of going to put this as twofold. Because here's the thing, man. They say those people over there in Israel, they say that they that they're the people of God, right? You read that. Huh. This is uh, Deuteronomy 37, uh, so like 28 and 37. It says, and thou shalt become an astonishment, a proverb, and a byword. So here so 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 here's the thing, right? The the people over there in Israel that claim to be the people of God, and everybody claims that they're the people of God, right? You see how the, you see how Deut Deuteronomy 28 just doesn't this doesn't add up. I mean, none none of the Bible adds up with them as far as, as far as them being the true people of the most high. None of the Bible adds up with them, but but this is just another thing. I know yesterday I brought out I brought out a, another thing that I can't uh, quite remember um, what it was, right? And yeah, it, it, no, that was that was something else. But how in the world are they the people of God when everybody sees them as the people of God? That, you, see that, you see how much sense that doesn't make? How in the world is everybody going to see them as the people of God? It's like, how are they the people of God when people, when the entire world sees them as the people of God? Right. You, can't e you can't even speak against them without getting flagged. In fact, they're making videos on it, on, 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 um, on anti-hate crimes against them. Right. They, you know, even throughout the scriptures, it shows, you know, it tells you that the real people of God are lost, right? The lost sheep of the house of Israel. That's, you know, that's they what they're saying, yep. So how would they be the real people of God if they're not lost? Exactly. If they're well known, they even got their own ambulance. Exactly. The, right? pe the people of God right now would not be referenced as the people of God. They will be They will be looked at like this is what you see on the screen. And I'm going to play the video a little bit. I had a uh, sound down. I'm going to play the video a little bit. Right, they want us looking like this too. That's how the people. That's how the people of God are going to look right now. What to the Israelites? Because what what did that scripture just now say? We're going to be an astonishment, a proverb, and a byword. Right, among all nations. Among all nations, all the all nations see them as the people of God. So here's the thing, right? What what is what is what is an astonishment? What is an astonishment? A waste, appallment, horror. Right. Uh, yep. A waste, even of a, a land and city. You know, it's a pe it's a it's a people before it's a uh, before it's a it's a place, right? So it says a proverb, uh, similar to parable. Yeah, we're 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 like a parable to them, man. You know what I'm saying? Um, sentences of uh, eth ethical or, or ethical wisdom. Okay, and a byword. You know what I'm saying? We is sharp cutting taunt, right? So we looked at it as all these names, and this is even even amongst our own, and we looked at it as an astonishment and a proverb and a byword, man. Right. An example of that is uh, Samson, right? You know when he was, you know the Philistines took him and they they was making a a, a mockery of him. You know they made him an astonishment. 
Right. Right. That's what they doing. You know, that's what ha what's happening with our people. Right. You know, we're we're in astonishment. Right. And see, that's that that proves. Now I'm gonna read this one, Deuteronomy 28 and 28. It says, "The Lord shall smite thee with madness and blindness and astonishment of heart." So again, and uh, so this is why I named this title uh, and another thing, you know, because I've been I've been going over this, like Joel, like like for example, Joel three. If nobody, and I mean nobody on this planet right now, likes trafficking so-called trafficking you know selling people you know you know what i'm saying nobody likes that right so joel 3 said what we're going to sell them say of, say of the lord to the saviors to a people far off if they're the people of god how come they're not selling people that's that's another question and i and i, and I, I mentioned that before if they're the people of god Right? If they're the real people of God, how come they're not selling people? I'm talking about I'm talking about actually trading, trading one another. You know what I'm saying? You can say they're doing that in the in the in the, in the celebrity thing, but I'm talking about openly doing it. I'm talking about actual trafficking. Why are they not doing that, man? If they're the real people of God. Why ain't the why ain't the entire world bowing down to them if they're the people of God? They're in that they're in that land. So everybody should be bowing down to them instead of instead of making war with them. Right? If they if that's if that's if they're in their land. So the Lord is going to smite thee with madness and blindness and astonishment of heart. The, the biggest that the biggest thing that everybody's doing videos on is this thing with uh Kiki Palmer. What what her talked about, you know, the 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 the, the the you know the average boss bitch stuff right where do you see where do you see the 48ers or women women doing that you ain't, you don't see them what was that uh, scripture i uh i have given thee up until vile affections right and we'll go ahead and get that real quick yep you don't you don't you don't see that man it's a lot let me see uh while you read that, uh, I got Joel 3. You get it. Uh, um, I'll start at 3 and 6. Uh, yep, it says, The children also of Judah and the children of Jerusalem have ye sold unto the Grecians that ye might remove them far from their border. Right? So, again, what happens since we're they down there selling people right now? You know? Right, because <laughs> everybody will have a problem with that. Right, but it's it's told that once we start selling people, you know, it's it's not going to be a problem. It's right, going that's, it's, it's it's lawful. It's lawful. It's going to be right. It's going to be in righteousness. Right. Yep. We're so how be, are they the people of God? Yeah. Separating families and shit like that. No, what we're going to be what we're going to be doing is going to be righteousness, man. Right. They got uh, uh, groups. That's coming even against them, which is you know even us coming against them. Yeah, if they're the people of God, we should we should we shouldn't have we should have no say. We should be bound down to them, and we should be at peace, not out here shooting and killing each other and shit like that. And and, and another thing too is that whoever who, whoever rules the world, see that's how you know, that's how you know that that they're wicked, man. Whoever rules the world is supposed the whole world is supposed to follow their order. Why are they not? Why, why are we not following their order? Right? Is it almost oh, it was, it was, I know it's probably more than that. Like two more verses. Yeah. Uh, it says, Behold, it's verse 7. I will raise them out of the place where ye have sold them, and will return your recompense upon your own head. And I will sell your sons and your daughters into the hand of the children of Judah. And they shall sell them to the Sabians, to a people far off, for the Lord have spoken. Why is that not happening right now? Among, amongst the 48 community. 
Romans chapter 1 verse 26 it says for, for this cause the Most High gave them up unto vile affections even their women did change the natural use into that which is against nature you see that you see that pretty much with almost every other nation too but mainly ours and mainly the Judites mainly the Judites but you see that mainly Israelites in general but I'm just saying mainly Judah is going to catch the, the worst of the curse because they're the, the Judah is the top tribe right and you and honestly you you look around you you wouldn't think so because Judah is all messed up but you can see but honestly to be honest even in their wickedness you can see that they're the top tribe of, of Israel this is why they catch the most of the curse this is where Yahweh that was where Yahweh Shai was from Judah right most of these you wouldn't you wouldn't think man you wouldn't think that the that these people looking like this it's the same tribe of the where in the world it really calls Jesus Christ. You wouldn't think that. But really it's not it's not hard to believe, to be honest. Well, especially when you're in this truth. It's not hard to believe, man. They cover things up. That's why an open dire, you know, it said how the hidden things of Esau are searched out and sought up. Right? You know, all all of his hidden things, he covered everything up. Right? He's lied to you. You know, these you look again, like you said, you look and be like, how is this the people of you know so-called Jesus, <laughs> right? You know, they're a bunch of uh, uh, sodomites and you know all kinds of crazy stuff. Yeah, you, you seriously, you, you wouldn't you wouldn't think so. But honestly, like you said, like honestly, it's not hard to believe. We we under a curse, and it's again we're we're under we're under vile affections. And so what curse are they under? <laughs> I, I don't know. You know what I'm saying? So Deuteronomy 28 does not does not add up. I mean, none, none of this stuff just adds up. You know what I'm saying? Nothing adds up with them. But being being the real people of the Most High, right? You got the world pretty much on their side. Every time somebody speaks out against them, you you looked at as anti-Sim, and it's just like, where did this come from? Where in the world? Where, where in the world did this come from? You get on Dr. Brown's show or, oh. or, or 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 vocab show, and they immediately say, "Well, no, you're wrong. No, you're wrong. No, you're wrong." And their followers, well, and they have millions of followers, and they'll say, "Yeah, absolutely, right." That just does just does just doesn't add up. The people of God are not going to be looked at as the people of God, right? His elect are not going to be looked at as the elect. We're going, the people of God is going to be looked at as pieces of shit. Especially the ones that's out there doing the will of the Father. Until this place is full. Until this place is full. This is why when, we, when we're out there, we get called all types of names. We even, we even sometimes get assaulted. And that's cool. but Because that, that proves that, yes, we are the true people of the Most High. If you dare assault one of those 48ers, you, if you dare do that, they're going to have your face plastered up. You know what I'm saying? Ten police cars are going to be lined up or just for you. Their own police cars. <laughs> they might even have their own police system, but you got the, but their, their own, their, the, the, the police system itself is with them. Because it's, it's a hate crime. But all of a sudden, they can walk by and call us all types of shit, and it's not a hate crime. It's just people arguing. All of a sudden, it's just people arguing. Right? So the people of God is going to be looked at as Deuteronomy 28, an astonishment, a proverb, and a byword. We're going to be we're, we're smitten with madness, and we're, we're going to be under vile affections. We're going to be looked at as total pieces of shit. Like I said, especially the ones that's out there doing the will of the Father. We're all going to be looked at as pieces of shit, a crazy, crazy niggas, right? The men are going to be down low. The women are going to be, uh, uh I guess we could say, so called up high, but they make it. That's making them weaker. The strong woman really is the weak woman. You want to know why? Because the definition of a strong woman in this society destroys them, man. And it makes them weak. And it makes the entire household weak. You remove the household. I mean, you remove the man out there. I don't talk about actual men. You Because you put the man in the household now, it ain't going to make no difference right now. Right? Because we are, they already so far gone. But I'm talking about you remove actual men and even actual women out of the households, man. Because these mothers are not mothers. These women are not women. The actual women are gone, too. 
This is a small few of men and women. The rest, again, they, they're, male, they're male and female. But you remove the man out of the household and you uplift the woman, that makes the entire household weak, man. And little do you know, Esau, right? And this is why this is why uh, uh, the Jake that was doing a video, it was, it was pretty good, right? And it was a real short. This is why Esau, little do y'all, little do y'all know, what you're doing is the will of the Father. This right here, what you see right now on the screen, this is the will of the Father, man. Right? That's what we was just now. That's why I said this is probably gonna go twofold a little bit, right? What you was just now, what you just now read in Deuteronomy 28 and Romans 1 and 26, the vile affections. The, what did it just say in Romans 1 and 26? The Lord gave them up to vile affections. He gave us up to vile affections, man. He's the one that does everything. He's the one that does all. Little do you know, Esau, what you're doing is, is, is all of the will of the Father. <laughs> Little do you know. So you think, you, you think you're doing something in which I guess you could give yourself credit. You are. Through the will of the Father. Right? right. Satan follow Satan follows orders from so called Jesus, man. Man's goings are of the Lord. Exactly. So that so man's goings being of the Lord go, even goes to the to, to the spiritual realm too. Satan so the one the world inevitably calls Jesus Christ commands Satan to do everything that, that he that he's doing right now. So called Jesus gets gets um orders from the Father. There's a chain of command even in the spiritual realm, man. Esau knows this. But what he doesn't know is again, Satan is in Satan so called Jesus is in control of Satan. So while you Edomites are doing this, and this is why you're getting mad and you can't really do anything about it because you're, you're you're getting very upset. Because now that you see we're starting to wake up, that is the will of the Father. The Lord is the one that does everything. And the Lord is the only one that, that can bring us out of this thing, man. Alright, so anyway, uh, that's pretty much it on this video. It ain't nothing else, ain't, ain't nothing else to say. Yeah, so give it all praise, honor, glory to you. How about you? Shimmy, I was shot by 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 Shimmy, I